I was really hoping we'd see a bit of a break so people could get home safely on this evening commute, but that doesn't seem to be the case. Nope, it does mm, not. Nope. Yeah, yeah. I mean, this is obviously our first winter storm of the season. We've seen some recent snow accumulation, but this is obviously several inches in a day right. with more inches on the way for tonight. Wow. So it's needless to say hazardous road conditions. Mm -hmm. I've seen a lot of traffic reports that are not good. Right. But tomorrow we do catch a break. That's we good have, news. Yeah, we do catch that break and it's good. Help us to shovel and clear things out. And at least I would say one positive is that this is a light and fluffy kind of snow. That is true. It's easier to shovel, easier to brush off your car. It's because it's so cold. I shovel today. Many people are worried about me because I'm pregnant, but it is light. <laughs> you heard it from Dustin. He's the expert. It is. You know, it's not that wet, heavy kind, right? Right. Well, let's, talk, let's have a look first because we do still have that winter storm warning in place. That's valid tonight through 11 p.m. Right around 11 or midnight is when all of our snow should be done. Not all of Mid Michigan is under the warning. You see the purple color winter weather advisory in our southern counties. That's because they have lesser snow amounts down there. This central band is right where we've been seeing the heavier snowfalls. The recent reports have been around the two, three inch range. I expect uh, some spots might be a little higher, but we still have a few more inches on the way for tonight before this is all done. But snow currently over all of our viewing area. A lot of the state dealing with that snow. A look outside our East Lansing Sky Cam. Low visibility for any students walking around campus. I don't expect many people to be out and about in this weather. Of course, it is also very cold. Upper teens to low 20s. The average high this time of year, 35. 19 is our high for the day here in Lansing. Add in a little bit of a wind. It's not terribly strong, but when it's already this cold, you don't need a good, strong, gusty wind. Wind chill is already into the single digits. Yeah, it adds a serious bite to the air if you're spending any time, even just walking to and from places tonight. Local radar zooming out is still showing all that snow across lower Michigan, but look west, not as much snow. We're on the last legs of this system here. A few more hours of this steady snowfall, it will be wrapping up tonight's part of your weather headlines. So yes, evening snowfall at times heavy. We have additional accumulations around another two, four inches or so, and that will be ending by about midnight. Remember that winter storm warning expires at 11. Most of the snow wrapping up right around that time. We have more snow in my seven day forecast. That'll be likely on Friday, but nothing quite so heavy as what we're experiencing today. So in your future track tonight, here we go. More snow falling. The heaviest right about now through the next hour or two. By the time we get towards 8, 9 p.m., notice it's starting to break apart. We're starting to see breaks in that snowfall there. By the time we get towards 11, midnight, most of it should be gone. Moved away eastward, and then we'll see drying conditions tonight. Even losing some of our cloud cover, we could see some sunshine tomorrow. I am still expecting maybe partly cloudy skies, but a lot of the models do suggest drier conditions with some of that sunshine, and that will be good to help clear away some of our road conditions, you know, making it a little bit easier to shovel, of course, until we get a bit more snow on Friday to see some of that rolling in, but it's not as much, maybe another inch or so on Friday. Predicted snowfall for the rest of your evening. A few more inches. I'm expect, expecting about two to four inches for the remainder of your evening, but lesser amounts south. Nine degrees, your overnight low. Evening snowfall clearing and cold tomorrow up to about 18. A cold day, partly cloudy, but we'll see a little bit of that sunshine. To, uh, tomorrow will be one of the coldest days of my seven day because it does warm up a bit. When's the last time I talked about warmer weather? And by warmer, I mean above freezing. It has been, I think, seven days now below freezing. Wow. It gets above freezing this weekend, but still a bit more snow on the way for Friday and again on Sunday, but nothing quite so heavy as what we're experiencing. That'll be nice. Yeah. All right, Dustin, thank you. Well, some people despise the snow. Others can't wait to go play in it. So let's